Can I play it? Oh, I can. Yeah. Dramatic things are happening. <laughs> the ent <laughs> is the entirety of Moby Dick in this game? Is that even legal? We fail. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo, hey, we fam. Welcome back, friends, indie game fans, and anyone who happened to check out this video from the recommended list on YouTube. My name is Mikey, and today we're getting into a new one. Today's game goes by a name that I don't think has anything to do with the premise, but I guess that's uh, all in time that we will find out. And that game is Tux and Fanny. Yes, I'll say it again, Tux and Fanny. It is $9.99 on the North American eShop, released September 9th, 2021. It's a one-player adventure puzzle role-playing game published by Ghost Time Games, developed by the same Ghost Time Games. Game file size 691 MB. Support languages include English. It is rated E. 10 plus for crude humor, mild blood, mild fantasy violence. Let's not waste any more time and get on into it. So the one thing I know about this game is that I've seen it described as a point and click. That's not so much a point and click. So uh, just going off of that basic knowledge and a few screenshots, I was pretty excited to pick this one up on the eShop and just figure out uh, you know, what it's all about. From the description, it says that when you take a closer look, everything is an adventure. Tux and Fanny just want to play soccer, but their soccer ball is deflated. I've been there. Go on an epic adventure to help them inflate their ball. Play as both Tux and Fanny, as well as a cat and a flea. All four characters will have to work together if you're going to inflate the ball. I don't know, is it one person to hold the deflated ball and three to pump, or some other variation? Casually poking a skull. Nice. Very uh, interesting introduction here so far. And uh, apparently they have ears, so that's something. Don't know what you're gonna do with that information, but uh, yeah. Now you know. A nice day. Let's go ahead and start a new game. That's the only option I have here, and they're looking at me like they want me to hurry up. So, uh, I get to choose either Tux or Fanny, it looks like. But it looks like if I choose one, the other one gets sad, so I don't know who to choose. Um, let's go ahead and play with Fanny here. I think that's Fanny. This really is a nice day. I can smell the flowers and hear the bees buzzing. Alright, just looking around here on the sides of the screen. Has some different uh, icons. It looks like continues the only thing I can do at this time. I have so much I want to do today, but first, I'd like to play soccer with my friend. Let's go play soccer. Alright, and I can move Fanny and have the option to look at Tux. Hey Tux, come with me. And now Tux is following me. That's the soccer ball right there. First off, that is huge. That is a huge soccer ball. That's definitely larger than regulation. Um. Let's see what this thing is. Oh, I can look at the clover. Hopefully that's a sign of good luck. I know it's not four leaves there, but uh, you know, it's something. I know it's extremely rare to find a four leaf clover, but that won't stop me from looking. And I will look at every clover I can find if I see them. I wonder if these little grass patches, yeah, they don't do anything. All right, let's... Uh, Let's see, before I look at the ball, I just want to see, can we do anything else? Home is where the heart is. Amen. Let's see, you can turn on the TV. I wonder what's on TV. Ah, Snow, my favorite channel. 
Better check the antenna on the roof. Sounds dangerous. Look out the window. I love that old apple tree. Maybe later I'll sit under the tree and daydream for a bit. Sounds like a nice life. There we are, Tux and I have never looked better. <laughs> Those are my handsome, handsome people there. Oops, I forgot all about this old safe. Um, I mean, th there's no way I'm going to guess this if it goes up to nine. Yeah, that's way too many numbers. I'm guessing it's uh, something I'll figure out later on. So I will leave that. But at least now I know where the safe is. Look at the jar. What can I put in this glass jar? Well, perhaps a life potion. Magic potion. A fairy. Your drugs. Just an ordinary fly swatter. Oh, I took it with me. Look at the flower book. It's our flower book. Flowers we have seen. Oh, number for the safe. It's not there. When we see a new flower, we will draw it inside this book. Buttercup. Bluebells, cactus flower, crocus, dandelion, daffodil, flower, elephantus, forsythia, hyacinth, ghost orchid, iris lily, the valley, palm flower, panda blossom, peony, rose, skull, perennial, sunflower, water poppies, water lily, wildflowers, corpse flower. There's a lot of flowers you can find in this game. Every house should have a cat in it. And there's a classic cat clock on the wall. I should turn the TV off. I'm going to leave this room. Very, very smart. Something my mom definitely would have told me. Oh, one of our buttons fell off the cork board. I'll put it back there now. Look at the button. No place sweeter than home. And even in the pin, my ball is still flat. <laughs> buttons, collect them all. Bad boy bubble. Selfish snake. Skull legs. Free beer. I'm looking forward to finding some of those. Pick up the kettle. Trusty kettle. I wonder how many cups of tea you have made in your lifetime. Mm hmm. Two thumbtacks, a broken rubber band, and a pair of scissors. I'll take these scissors. They might come in handy. Okay, I'm collecting lots of items here. I shouldn't waste the water if I don't need it. Agreed. Magnet on the fridge. This magnet is powerful. Pick up bread, my favorite. Yuck, this bread is old. Perhaps our feathered friends in the pond might enjoy it. I think I think I heard recently on Twitter that it's actually not ideal to feed ducks bread. Or, yeah, I think it was ducks or geese, one of the two. They said to bring like something else, like some seeds or something. There's probably some truth to that, but I, I did grow up as a kid going to the park, feeding, uh, feeding bread to the ducks. So many records, so little time. Congratulations, you have found the record player. You can use the shortcut to change the music at any time. Wait, let's try. Let's try Journey May steps. There we go. It's 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 there. It's subtle. Look at the fish. Oh, fish, you have such a carefree life you live. You don't pay taxes. You have no bills to pay. Uh-oh, where did I put your food? Yes, but you are at the mercy of me, and if I can find your fish flakes, your food. Can I play it? Oh, I can. Yeah. Dramatic things are happening. Masterpiece. Playing piano is nice, but I play much better when Tux is here dancing. I'll have to see that later on. An easel. A blank canvas. Plenty of paint, but no paintbrush. Maybe I can make one. Look at the root. I have a root growing in our house. <laughs> that sounds like an insurance issue. That's strange. There's a tree root growing up through the floorboards. 
that floppy disk. What's this computer disk doing down here? Home simulation. Ah, uh -huh. I love this game. I should load it back onto the computer and play it for a bit. I'm gonna break some fourth walls here pretty soon. Congratulations, you have unlocked a new software to use on the computer. Oh. Sorry, Tux, but uh, <laughs> that home game is calling me. What a special machine. All right, we can play the computer. Let's see what we got. Home simulation start. My name is Victoria. I love my house. I can see why uh, Fanny enjoys this game. <laughs> they have a very similar setup. I wonder if this is maybe perhaps... Oh, I can play on the computer in the game? All right, hold on. Before I get into this, I have a theory that maybe this could have been an early version of Tux and Fanny, or could have been like a, I don't know, like some kind of idea uh, laid out. I don't know, maybe maybe it is, maybe it's not. I think I'll play my new computer game, Residence Replication. <laughs> yeah. Yes, let's do it. <laughs> My name is Gleb. I live here. I live here in my home. I am home. And we're gonna get deeper and deeper into this rabbit hole, I hope. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Those boundaries. Is that hot sauce? Yes, this is my computer. Now I will play a computer game. It is called Cabin Copy. Yeah, deeper. I'm Izom Izomir, and I am happiest, strong in my cabin. It is warm, so and best, and <laughs> it is warm, so and best, not other places. Yes, Banana Man. Where's the computer? Oh yeah. All right, we're taking it even deeper. How deep? I know my Kumaputer game well before I start playing. Hidden numbers safe? Is it the safe? Let's see. Any? Do we see anything? Oh, what, what's going on here? Looks like an error in the game. But what's this? Looks like one of the numbers for our safe. I'll save that just in case. I like playing video games and pretending I'm someone else for a bit. <laughs> Can I go upstairs? Hey, I can. Look at the books. So many books. Which one shall I read today? Structure manual. Pictures of bugs. Secret door. Let's look at pictures of bugs. Over a thousand high resolution photographs from the world's leading entomologists compiled by Gerald Gerard M. Wallach. Fly. A fly is a frog's favorite meal. They, I like how they added that in there. Like this is new knowledge. I better write that down. Mealybug, ladybug, flea, caterpillar, hornet. Smoke is efficient is an efficient way to get them to retreat. Oh, good idea. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Let's go smoke some hornets. Yeah, you heard me. I can make it full screen. Nice. Firefly, grasshopper. Would you like to read more? Yes. Secret door. Ah, Secret Door, a descriptive piano composition by Jeanette de Sanitas. Ah, perfect. That all makes sense now. Good thing I can read Chicken Scratch and Ink Blots. 337. I'm going to save that. I don't know if that's a piano combination or maybe uh, I can put it in the safe, possibly. Yes, disguised digits. Sometimes a finger is not a finger. Sometimes a toe is not a toe. Within these pages are the answers to questions you'll never know. Big Baby dropped it again? <laughs> Hold on. I'm going to read this. I'll fast forward, but I want to read this real quick. I can't remember the combination for the safe. All I remember is one, another. Let's keep reading. Reliable Recipes by Molly Koshka. Tea. A used tea bag is great for deodorizing things. 
I don't, I don't know if that's true. Custom Costumes by Juliet Tregeisel. I do need some Halloween inspiration. Ghost. Simply combine scissors in a white sheet. Well, I got the scissors. I just need to find the white sheet. Fox. A sewing kit and fox fur. Ah, yes. Alien. Old basketball, green paint. Okay. Sure. More book. Well, let's... I read them all. Let's check out this real quick. Tux and Fanny. That is going to be the thumbnail picture right there. Nice. This is this is actually a cool way, a very uh, unique way to put the instruction manual in the game. Um, with, with games not carrying physical instruction manuals anymore, this is nice to see. And uh, I appreciate it. And I didn't know that you can play as both characters, so I'll have to figure out how you do that. Wait, I missed something. There we go. Now a major motion picture. All right. Yeah, let's keep reading. See what else we got. Oh, boy. There are a lot of books in here. All right. Must be this part up, too. Catch you on the other side of the bookshelf, friends. The ent <laughs> is the entirety of Moby Dick in this game? Is that even legal? Congratulations, you have unlocked a new commemorative button in light of your achievements. Listen now. Enter a new world. Read a book. Since I've read every book on our bookshelf, there's only one thing left to do. Read them all again. Yeah. The Model Menace. Written by Pip Dungles and illustrated by I love it. I'm going to let it play while I play. But she didn't live there alone. Beautiful. Oh, Gotta find a paper clip. They were a happy tiger family. So peaceful up here. I love seeing the land from above. I can even see the duck pond. Ouch, said Francis. I'll need to see the doctor about this. But before Francis left to see the doctor, she turned to Mimi. Mimi, you are the oldest tiger when I'm gone. That means you are a role model to the others. Yep. Be mindful of how you act. Yep. Mimi nodded. She was to see the doctor. Ah, oh, they do have different dialogues when you look at the same thing. Does that mean I have to do the same with both of them? Well, her mother wasn't there to scold her. I mean, I don't mind, but... She could play with her food. Yep. She could splash in the back. Hey, watching soccer on TV, let's go. Pump up the volume. Cool cloud two. The coolest cloud just got cooler. Meals with Molly. <laughs> oh no, it's gonna happen. That's actually really creepy looking. Wait a minute, is that one of the numbers for the safe? I should write it down. Thanks, Goose. So what was it? 517 so far, I believe. There we go. A beautiful view of the apple tree. With a, what a mighty tree overflowing with fruit. Yeah, this is a great spot to do nothing, but I have too many other things to do right now. Reminds me of that meme where it's like, when you have so much to do, you decide to take a nap instead. 
It's a flower book. Oh yeah, they wrote them down. Nice. Yep, 517. I was right. Beautiful water, the liquid of our lives. Oh, I gotta fill the kettle with water to make tea, but I don't have a tea bag. Oh, there it is. Tea kettle. Water. Um, oh, it was X. That's what it is. Tea kettle full of water. I used to have this recurring dream when I was younger. In the dream, I would be walking on the ceiling and my arms and legs felt really heavy, almost like they were made of steel. As soon as I realized I was upside down on the ceiling, I'd fall to the floor. Just then I'd hear a car horn honking and run to the window to see who it was. I th I'd see a red truck speeding through a field. Then I'd look over and next to the window there was a hole in the wall. I peer into the hole and see a bird stuck down in the wall. I try to get it out, but I can't reach it. It's usually when I wake up. I haven't had that dream in a long time. Tea's wait. <laughs> Tea's not ready. Kettle's ready. Ah, yes, yes. The bachelor lifestyle. Yikes, not much in here but some mustard and a moldy strawberry. Guess I'll take the strawberry. Sure. Um, I wonder if I can keep going rather than... Oh, I can play Happy Animals. This is my favorite game. Let's play. What's the happiest animal you can make? An anthocene. Antelope. Armadillo. Oh. Oh. A rack phase. Thing is majestic. A rack facade. Let's make one more. See them, mix them. Wolvadim. Yeah, it looks like he's got some armor on. Okay. Look at the grandfather clock. Tick tock. What a lovely grandfather clock. Look at the cloud posters. Clouds we have seen. That's pretty cool, actually. Look out the window. Nice view of our back patio. Maybe I'll give it a visit later. What else we have? Magnifying glass. If anyone mind, if I borrow the magnifying glass, I want to look for some bugs. Take it. Birds and bugs. This is our bird and bug journal. All the birds and bugs we see appear here. It's nice to keep track of the ones we've seen. When you hear a bird singing, take out the binoculars, look into the trees. How to find bugs, take out your magnifying glass and look under rocks. Okie doke. Lots to find, lots to find. Yeah, let's go find some birds later. We got books. Let's see if we can go over one more. Oh, we can. This is a pretty big house. I should put this hat back in the closet with the rest of our clothes. Sure. What is that? Sewing kit filled with colorful thread. Okay. What should I wear today? Sneakers. Yup. What should I wear today? Hat. Oh, you can only wear one. Uh, let's wear the hat. My trusty synthesizers. Who knows what wild melodies it'll unveil today? How do I? Oh. Nice. Sweet. I like that. Wait, I can change the settings? Oh, what? This thing is cool. Oh, can you, you can record in here? Hold on. Yo, hold on. Oh, uh, hold on. Here we go. Hold on. Hmm. Uh. It 
turn that tempo up. I need some like some snaps or some claps in there. <laughs> All right, enough of the synthesizer. Let's get out of here. Got some. What's that? Oh, it's like that lotion. Don't want to use that for lotion. Glue is great. You never know when it'll come in handy. Let's take it. When the world is dark, this little lamp is a reassuring beacon of light. Fanny's bed. Fanny has a nice bed, but I like my bed more. Let's pick up the floor here. Oh, here's my construction paper. I love to make some drawings, but first, I need to find the magic markers. Any more room? Oh man, it keeps going. Wow. Let's see what's under my bed. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, that's, that's where my old basketball has been. Can we paint it green? Make an alien costume? Might as well take this with me. Might come in handy down the road. Hey, got an old basketball. Let's see what's under Fanny's bed. No, don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Uh? Ah! I'm not sure why Fanny has this under the bed, but I'm terrified. Okay, little monkey. Look at the bath. I'm not dirty. I should only take a bath when I'm dirty. Look in the mirror. Hey, looking good. Sometimes it's nice to look in the mirror and remember what you look like. Hey, true that. Oh, we got lots of stuff in here. That's my favorite mug. Perfect perfect for making a cup of tea in. Uh, you gonna grab it? All right. Oh, the fish is probably hungry. I should probably feed it before I do anything else. Is the, is, oh, okay, I was gonna say, is that the fish food? Fish chow? Why did Fanny put the fish food in the bathroom? Oh, well, better take it back downstairs. Will do. Oh, got the lighter. Paradise. My favorite lighter because it has a palm tree and says paradise. Candle? I should use the lighter to bring this candle to life. I don't know if I want to light the candle and then leave to go feed the fish. Uh, don't know if that's the best idea. But, um, I guess we'll find out. Why am I so drawn to a flame? I feel like it hypnotizes me. Ooh. Ah. So much movement, so much power. It's nice to watch the wax melt. Oh, look. The wax is on the table. Hey, let's go. Wow, the wax looks like one of the numbers for the safe. What a lucky break. I guess it's a good thing that uh, I did do that. I just need to see if there's anything back here, because who knows? Oh, what do you know? Just our linen closet. Nothing important to see back here. Yeah, that's what you think. New record, Great Can or Grand Canyon Rescue episode band. Chatham lullaby. Let's listen. Anything else? Uh huh. Some toilet paper. We're well stocked. Blow out the candle. Let's take off. Hello, fish. How are things? You have a nice... Oh, what a nice life. Oh, yeah. Gotta use the item. Forgot. Nice. Fish fed. Here you go, little buddy. A3. Oh, look. A number for the safe. We're almost done. I think we'll need one or two numbers for the safe. Crazy. I feel like if I played that happy animals a little bit longer something might happen but um let's see we'll do a couple more times opopotope <laughs> rack faros rack faros we fan, <laughs> yo, <laughs> yo, hey, we fam. I don't think I'll get one better than that. Ant famous, Hippodine. 
I like this game too. Where did I leave my friend? Up on the roof. What was I gonna do? Oh. <laughs> yep. So we turned the TV on. I was able to watch it, but did I find anything there? I, I can't even remember now. I was having too much fun with that synthesizer. Uh, okay, so now that I don't know, I think I'll have to start venturing outside. I did see a lot inside so far, but I think that's a great place to end our first look for today of Tux and Fanny. Tux and Fanny, remember, is $9.99 on the North American eShop. Came out September 9th, 2021. One player adventure puzzle role playing game. Let me know what you thought about Tux and Fanny in the comments below. Hit that thumbs up if you liked the video. Let me know who your favorite character is. Do you like Tux? Or do you like Fanny? Are you a fan of the piano or the synthesizer? Have you read Moby Dick before or was this your first time? Let me know down in the comments below. But that's gonna do it for me tonight. My name is Mikey. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay sane, stay playing indies and I'll see you next time. Bye.